All right, making news around town, she's known as the Quiet Book Queen, but she does all sorts of crafts in between, and now she's about to be a published author again. Joining us in studio is Kaylin Carr, a local <laughs> mom and parenting advocate who has been changing lives, not just here at home, but around the world with her creative and clever company. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for having me. I love that you have a stack of books. This is a beautiful thing, but it all started with the quiet books. Tell us about those. Yes, so quiet books are these felt activity books that I made for my kids. I did a swap and so that they could have fun things to do while we're out and about and not have to rely on a screen to keep them entertained. Yeah, and I know it's so great because I'll be watching your Instagram stories and you're using a great screen to reach parents because you know that's where we're <laughs> plugged in. And you're saying, here's all these ideas to keep your kids unplugged. How has that success been so far? Oh, amazing. I love helping parents and empowering the society we live in is so screen focused. Mm -hmm. And I love telling parents and helping them realize they don't have to resort to the screens that you see all around. Like, you, there's still a way. I have a, a shirt, play like a 90s kid, play like an 80s kid, like how we used to do. Screens yes. aren't bad, but they are not the end all be all. Kids yeah. need to know how to entertain themselves and they practice do. that. And it, it's, I like letting my kids get bored. And that's an inspiration yes. that you gave me. <laughs> Full disclosure, I'm a, I'm a client, I'm a customer. I love your activities that you send out every month. My kids will sit down and create a completely new game out of something else. Like you sent us a pretend library one mm -hmm. month. It has been beautiful. And now you're turning all of these activities into these books. Tell us about the Kickstarter campaign for your newest book. Yes, so I'm an author published traditionally through these four, but I have a manuscript here for this is a book that I wrote and I wanted full control um, and I so I got to pick the illustrator I hired that out and now to get the funding to get them printed that costs a lot of money so I wanted to do a Kickstarter campaign it's a way to pre-order the book and get those funds to do that and so I started that it's a weekend last Tuesday and I've made over $11,000 so far in pre-orders. I beat my goal in 12 hours. It's been amazing, but we're not done yet. <laughs> we're not done we're yet. We're not done yet. We still have the more money I can earn, the more books I can buy and support and just spread this message to prioritize play. Exactly. So you can easily find her on Kickstarter. What is your website as well for people to reach out? My website is quietbookqueen.com and if you go there for activities for three to seven year olds, I have free printables that you can get. My website to support my book is uh, screensawaytimetoplay.com. And it's just fantastic. Kaylin Carr, thank you again. Congratulations. Thank you I'm so excited much. to see you keep going and I'm excited to get outside and play in this beautiful weather. We'll have more on that weather coming up. Thank you so much.